Okay guys, this is my second channel, Unplugged, which is about the electric car we are driving here in Australia. Um, it's an additional channel to our personal, not private, but personal channel, Living Down Under, where you can always see what we are doing in our free time and um, if you are interested in our personal life, check out the other channel, Living Down Under. Okay, so back to the car. Well, um, so I'm trying to explain a little bit what's happening with the car and um, yeah, I share some of my experience, positive and negative. This will all be updated on this channel in more or less regular videos here. So I hope you enjoy. If you want to see particular things, just leave a comment down in the description and I'll try to make this as interesting as possible for you. So at the moment the car is in the service center because of a battery issue I have with the car. Battery means I'm talking about the drive battery which propels the electric motors. I just had a call from the service center and they found there is a software update available for the car which they will do overnight and they will get back to me tomorrow with some updates. So hopefully we know a little bit more tomorrow but I doubt it is related to a software problem on the car. Why is this camera actually not straight? So that's better. It may be partly related to a software problem, I don't know. But the main problem is the huge degradation the battery already has after after 58, 59,000 kilometers, which is 59,000 kilometers, which is less than 37,000 miles. On the Australian website you can find this FAQ about the car and there's an interesting point. Um, will I need to replace PHEV's drive battery pack? And it says the battery is not a service item which is expected to need replaced during the vehicle's life. And replacement is not included in PHEV's maintenance schedule. Top. Okay. Um, there will be some natural degradation of the lithium-ion battery chemistry over the life of the vehicle, which could lead to a small reduction in pure EV range. This is expected to be no more than 20%. So they are saying the battery is not degrading more than 20% over the lifetime of the vehicle. Lifetime of the vehicle is probably 15 years at least. I would say 15 years is fair, but I would say 15 years is a fair use of a vehicle these days. So 20% less battery capacity in 15 years. I've got 19.2% degradation already after three and a half years and 37,000 kilometers. So I'm not sure what that means. Um, I think we have to wait for the service center to give us an update tomorrow.